Mazda's current CX-9 crossover has long been a favorite among our staff, but the larger and more premium 2024 CX-93 row SUV appears poised to move the company's biggest SUV further up the luxury mountain. The CX-90 will debut a new turbocharged 3.3-liter inline-six engine making either 280 or 340 horsepower as well as a plug-in hybrid powertrain option. Mazda's premium aspirations lead us to believe that this range-topping three-row eight-seater will offer more luxury features than its current crop of SUVs. Its styling is handsome, and the CX-90's cabin design borrows cues from the smaller CX-50 and MX-30 SUVs. The all-new architecture that the CX-90 is built on is expected to also spawn a two-row SUV named CX-70, which should go on sale shortly after the CX-90. The CX-90 will be a new nameplate for the Mazda brand when it goes into production sometime in 2023. It is unknown if the CX-90 will replace the current CX-9 in Mazda's lineup or if it will be offered alongside the smaller three-row model moving forward. While we haven't driven the CX-90 yet, we're intrigued by the new inline-six, particularly in its top S-tune which pumps out 340 horsepower. The S model also comes well equipped with niceties such as second row captain's chairs, a 12 speaker Bose stereo system, interior ambient lighting, 21 inch wheels, a panoramic sunroof, a hands free power lift gate, and more. Engine, transmission, and performance. The CX90 will be the first Mazda to use a new turbocharged 3.3 liter inline six engine that is augmented by a 48 volt hybrid system. Mazda says the powertrain is good for 280 horsepower in non-S trims and 340 in S trims. An inline six-cylinder engine is a hallmark of SUVs such as the BMW X5 and the Land Rover Range Rover Sport, signaling Mazda's desire to move its brand even more toward the premium end of the market. A plug-in hybrid variant will also be offered, using the same 323 horsepower setup used in the European market CX60 SUV comprised of an inline four-cylinder engine, an electric motor, and a 17.8 kilowatt-hour battery pack. All models come with an eight-speed automatic transmission and, much like the rest of the Mazda SUV lineup, the CX-90 has all-wheel drive standard. When we can drive the CX-90 for ourselves, we'll update this story with driving impressions. Fuel Economy and Real-World MPG The EPA has not released fuel economy estimates for the plug-in hybrid CX-90 model yet, but the inline six is rated for up to 24 miles per gallon city and 28 miles per gallon highway. The plug-in hybrid powertrain will likely be more efficient and come with at least 30 miles or so of electric driving per charge. Interior, comfort, and cargo. To accompany its upscale exterior, Mazda has endowed the CX-90 with a stylish cabin design that features room for up to eight passengers. Opt for the second row captain's chairs and the total seating drops to seven. The fabric dashboard upholstery in the high-end models looks striking, and the seats in those trims are also wrapped in soft Nappa leather. Base select trims are more spartan but no less handsomely styled. Although leather is standard starting on the preferred trim, the more upscale and buttery-looking Nappa leather upholstery is reserved for premium plus levels and above. Infotainment and Connectivity a 10.3 or larger 12.3-inch infotainment display is nestled into the dashboard and controlled via a click wheel on the CX-90's center console. Mazda's latest infotainment interface is easy to navigate and relatively intuitive. Apple CarPlay and Android Auto are both standard, and we expect that there will be wireless connectivity for both. The CX-90 also features a 7.0-inch digital gauge display and an 8-speaker stereo system. A larger 12.3-inch digital gauge cluster is optional, as is a 12-speaker Bose Premium Stereo. Stay tuned to Auto RBX for all the latest, and let us know your thoughts in the comments, and don't forget to subscribe to the channel.